When people are facing a serious illness, their needs go beyond medical treatment. Medical and public health social workers can be a lifeline for patients and their families. A patient about to be discharged from a hospital might need home care, meal delivery, and special equipment. There will be a nurse coming to your home uh -huh. two times a week for the first two or three weeks. The social worker can help arrange these services and determine if there is financial support available. Such practical assistance can relieve a lot of stress. But just as important is the psychological and emotional support that social workers are trained to provide. With an aging population, more medical and public health social workers will be needed in the years ahead. Jobs will be available in hospitals, nursing care and mental health facilities, as well as doctor's offices and public health clinics. A specialized bachelor's degree called a BSW is the minimum requirement. Many social workers have a master's degree or a doctorate in their field. There are also licensing requirements which vary from state to state. Two characteristics that are always required are patience and emotional strength. Because medical and public health social workers spend their days taking up the burdens of others, this work can be emotionally draining. The reward is knowing that at a time when people often feel helpless, you're there to